Hello guys, it's Hazardween here. Today's horror game has been says called Shadow Fang, which is created by the same game developer as The Crawler. In this horror game, it's about two guys who go into the forest to pick some mushrooms and decide to stay for a few nights. But the more they stay, the more they get this uneasy feeling that they're being watched. So, if you guys would like to play a game for yourself, there is a link for that down in the description. In the meantime, let's dive right in. Okay. We're in. The Crawler. Haha. Nice little Easter egg to the recent game. I like it. Oh. Who are you? You look like Harry Potter. <laughs> That's like call me Kevin but with glasses. Bob. Hey Alex. Ready for a mushroom picking trip today? Yeah. Oh hey Bob. I haven't prepared yet but I'll get everything together up right after we finish talking. Sure. No worries, just make sure you've got your gear, flashlight, sleeping bag and snacks. Got it, I'll pack everything after we finish talking. Great, once you're ready, we hop in the car and head out for our adventure and pick some fucking mushrooms. Sounds like a plan, I'll be ready in no time. I wonder what they're planning to do with the mushrooms. Garage. Oh, we're not in this house, are we? Yeah, it looks like the same house asset from Clap Clap, but cut in half. Right, is that my backpack? Gotta set my book. Right, we're staying for a few nights, aren't we? So. Oh. Anything we're gonna take? Backpack. Toothbrush. Wait, I think I forgot something. I should pick it up. What have you forgotten? What is it? Pizza? Oh. Sleeping bag. Why is it in here? Is that it? Is there anything more? Forgotten something. What have I forgotten now? Snacks? Okay. Just lays. Not the bowl of cereal in the hexagon bowl. Right, let's just the garage to get started. Let's go, Bobby! I wonder which one of us is going to be first to die. Oh, I bet there's going to be one of those um, <laughs> moments where we've had all these mushrooms, we eat it, we get a little bit high with the bit. Alex and Bob on the way to meet a local huntsman for the mushroom trip. I bet they pick the wrong mushrooms, eat one, and they go in on a bit of a trip, basically. They're eager to explore the unfamiliar forest of Southeast Asia. Ooh. Badger stumps there. Okay. This is the Huntsman. Okay, here we go. Excuse, excuse me, are you the local mushroom? I'm Alex. Indeed I am. You must be the seeker of mushroom, young Alex. Hi, I've heard you're the one to talk about rare mushrooms in these forests. I'm known as Payak. But in these forests, they call me the Shadow Tracker. The Shadow Tracker? That sounds intriguing. Here, yeah, lad, I've ventured to these paths for years, seeking out the rarest of nature's bounties. The rare mushrooms you seek is called Morning Shroom. Put a shroom in it. So we're trying shrooms, basically. I'm ready for the challenge, Shadow Tracker. I bet, I bet he's scamming you. He's going to make you um, do random shit. Bob, stop it. We're here. We better turn back. This area seems risky. I'm not feeling very safe here. Yeah, can we just go in our car and go back now? Nah. Let's continue our adventure. Right, I'm ready. Let's go. Oh, we have to go to our spot. <laughs> What are you doing? Whoa, you scared the heck out of me. You shouldn't be here. Listen to me. This forest is dangerous. Don't go in there. Thanks for the warning, but I've been planning this trip for ages. I'll be fine. You don't understand. This is too dangerous. At least promise me you won't stay out here after dark. The forest changes when the sun sets. Sure, sure. I hear you. Don't worry. I'll be back before sunset. 
I guess he's had the morning shrooms and things have gone wrong at night and then like in the morning it's a little bit different maybe? I don't know. Anyways, we're starting. Jesus Christ, he scared the living out of me. <laughs> he just appeared! The huntsman led us into the heart of the forest. He didn't even fucking move from the car. 8.45am. I should go talk to them and see if I can help. Would be wise. What am I doing? Bobby! What are you doing? Hey Alex, we have a bit of a problem. We forgot our meats back at the camp. Seriously? That's not good. What are we going to do? Don't worry, I already talked to the huntsman. He gave us an animal trap to use. That's already. So what's the plan? First you need to pick the morning mushrooms. They only appear early in the day. After that sets up the trap. Got it. What will you be doing? I'll start preparing our meal while you're heading... While you're handling the mushrooms and the trap. Sounds like a plan. Let's get to it. Hmm. Alright, sir. Hey, I need your help build, building shelter. Give me a hand. Sure, what do you need me to do? Let's start by gathering some wooden planks. We'll need a solid frame and good cover. After that, I'll set up the fire. Hmm. I've got mushrooms and some wood planks to collect. Ah, I like these. I pick more than more than two. Why can't he pick them himself? They're all around. Like he could, like he could have gone start the shelter, like both of them. <laughs> I suppose I've got to do some work on it. I am the protagonist at the end of the day. Ah, that's the last one. Here we go. I've got ten. Look at that! Oh! I built a masterpiece! Ha! You guys are going to be thanking me now, aren't you? Oh, I thought it was someone. I was a rock. I thought someone was stood at the base. I was like, oh, who's the third person? Now what? Am I going up? Ah! Oh. Yes! Look what I built, guys! So what do I need to do now? The pathway here. Do I go down this way? Ah, here we go. The shroom zone. I bet we're gonna eat a few. And things are just gonna go a little bit tits up. Alright. We're off on a shroom trip. We're about to go on another shroom trip tonight, probably, after our little stew. Or stir fry, whatever we're having. Hmm. Do morning shrooms actually exist? That's a question. Pick some mushrooms. Oh, I'm picking up mushrooms. I built a solid looking base. I don't need these two. I should have just gone on this trip on my own. Alright. Now what? I should go set up trap before it gets dark. Better get it done while it's still on a flight. Sure. Oh, up there. I see the little circle. Is that all we're having? What is this? I can't see. Is that noodles? We've got broccoli, two onions, a garlic, and two heads of cabbages. Boring! We're going to have some rice or anything in this, make it a bit exciting, and some meat, I hope. Is that water? Oh. Sorry, I just drunk his water. Oopsie. Where's, where's that guy? Oh, he's upstairs. All right, let's put a trap down. The trap zone. Oh, hello. Who's that? 
Is that the guy from earlier who jump scared me? Hmm. Spooky. Alright, bear trap time. I bet during the I bet during the trip somebody footsteps. I bet during a trip somebody is gonna walk right into these traps. Last one going. Hmm. I wonder where that guy vanished to. Oh, right here. Right where I couldn't freaking see it. Alright. Alright, let's go. Time to get out of here. some sort of um, serial killer or something. Alright! The shelter is fully up and I should go meet them for dinner. I did this, actually! I guess our first meal is going to be vegetarian or something, isn't it? Because we've got no meat. Hello! <laughs> Alex, crabs for dinner! They smell amazing! Really? I've been looking forward to this. Bob always cooks great meals. You're in for a treat, then. Your friend cooking top notch, especially with the fresh ingredients from the forest. Do you mean the fox? Do you mean the mushrooms? Have some. Sorry, I've, I've, I've had to have a taste of your mushrooms. Hey, Alex. I'm making some noodles. I picked up a few ingredients from the forest. What ingredients did you pick from the forest? Really? That's impressive. What did you find? I found some wild herbs and a few edible plants. I should add a little flavour to the food. Or... Why what edible plants you put in? Or Unless you found more mushrooms or something. Hmm. Oh, it's me walking. Alright, here's my dinner. Mm, good old ramen. Have I got meat when we forgot the meat set back at the camp? That noodle was really good. Bob did an amazing job with these forest ingredients. And the mushrooms I found! Now it's time to get some sleep. Oh. I can't help but feel that something's going to peek through. Sleep time. Two fifty AM Sunday. Fifty. Alex. Oh, mate's just calling. I need to go for a splash. Okay. Okay, well we're getting up now. Something's gonna happen more often for a pee. Jesus, you're snoring, man. Ready? <sighs> Little fountain. Whee! Excuse me, I'm trying to piss. Oh my god. Back to go. Let's get back to sleep. Yep, run. Bye 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 bye. Fuck that. 
you not see them red eyes? Bad. Hmm. Well, sleep time. I always feel like. All right. Time to go pick up some mushrooms and check on the trap. More mushrooms? Are they that good? Hmm. Where did Bobby go? Where's Bob? Hello? Hey, have you seen Bob around? No, he went out early this morning to pick up some ingredients. Oh, okay. I hope he's back soon. And he's just going to take a seat. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. I did that. Three just made me laugh. Right. Bit of mushroom area was this way, wasn't it? I reckon the more we eat these mushrooms, the more of a trip we're going to get, I suppose. I don't know. Unless if we've just picked every bad spot in the forest where there's creatures and all sorts going on. And we'll check the traps. Oh! Footprints? They've not. Hmm. Big paws. Could have been that creature we saw with red eyes earlier, right? Maybe. Let's head back. I keep hearing footsteps. Anyway. <clears throat> Let's go. Little monster drink. Unleash the beast, literally. I should go check on the trap before it gets too dark. Same sort of shit. Who's that? Bob, why are you boxing? I swear to. <clears throat> Imagine if he did one punch and the whole shelter just falls down. Alright, leave you to it, mate. Imagine he was just dancing to something. <laughs> Let's go. To the trap zone. Oh! It's like, it's like a chinchilla. Anyways. A weirdo poking from behind. Hmm, maybe not yet. No. Oh, the random footsteps, like. Oh no, I'm so sorry, buddy. I'm so sorry, buddy. Oh, it's still alive. Is it still alive? No, it can't be. I was like, oh no. I'll save you, Mr. Rabbit. Back we go, we got some protein that we can scran. Oh, I am sure. Right. Back to camp with the two bunnies. With some bunnies. I'll get the wrap. I'll give a rabbit I caught in a trap to use a rabbit pig in my a meal. Was he back yet? You came back! Hey Alex, got a rabbit for you, mate. Thought you might want it for dinner. Oh, rabbit, excellent. Give it to me now. Well, I've got two of them. So, you best enjoy. 
Is this mine? Hmm. Looks interesting. Where's... Oh, hello, mate. Have some of that. Bro! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you can have mine. I, I swear. I'm sorry. <laughs> These noodles taste a bit salty. Maybe he added too much salt. Now it's time to get some sleep. No need to insult his dinner. <laughs> Why are you holding a knife? Do you eat your noodles with a knife? Jesus. Alright. Hey. Hey. Oh no. Hey, why don't you leave this forest? Come down here. Who said? What do you mean? The forest isn't safe. Calm down. It's better down here. Who is that? Ooh. Sit by the fire for a moment. There's something important we need to talk about. Okay. Well, I'm sat here now. Tell me. Where's Bob? Is he not supposed to be involved in these tales? Anyways. Alright, Alex. That stranger down there is dangerous. You shouldn't listen to him. Why do you say that? There's an old myth about... Sming. It's believed to be a tiger that killed many humans and then transferred into Sming. What the hell is that? Okay. All I got on Google is just a bunch of random sea creatures. <laughs> it has the ability to shapeshift into other people and lure them out to eat. Legend has it that it can even transform into a tiger. Like That's probably what them paw prints were when we were hunting for the mushrooms. We saw them paw prints going up the hill. And also we saw that guy peeking from behind that rock. Maybe we saw um, this creature right at the start when he ran out towards us and told us not to go into the forest. That's why it's trying to lower you down the ladder. They believe the tiger paws can't climb up. Well, have you ever seen a tiger climb up a ladder before? I don't know. <laughs> That's terrifying. Thanks for the warning. Yeah, okay. So it's either going to be we either trust the guy or someone actually comes out later and... Hmm. What if Bob or our huntsman guy... Sorry, last night and suddenly feeling sleepy. It's time to go pick up some mushrooms and check on the trap. I see Bob over there. Is he having a pee? Still got your knife, mate. But where did you get that shotgun from, by the way? Anyways, chatty chime. Morning! Hi, Alex. Good morning. Okay, it's just a good morning, good morning. Alright. Let's have some water. What? Is that meant to be coal? Hmm. What if Bob or Pyak become the creature and start lowering us? It's gonna be like, do I trust you? Do I not? Hmm. It's gonna be a weird thing, isn't it? Morning, Bob. Morning, Alex. Jesus. Anyways, right. Shrooms time. I don't like the random footsteps. Spooky. I mean, I was about to settle down, eat some crisps, drink some water, go to sleep. But instead, I got called out um, to have a horror story around the fire. Why wasn't Bob there to know about... I mean, didn't look like, didn't look like there was enough room, let's be honest. Are those paws still there? Or are they gone? No, they're gone. Hmm. I'm trying to keep out for sort of details, huh? Oh, 
Oh my. Anyways. With someone like, um, like authorities that the police don't arrive and they've also been, like, attacked by this creature and is now basically, um, part of the creature. <laughs> it's gonna be interesting to see how this all comes together. No trap there. Bunny rabbit, bunny rabbit. Imagine we go up to one of the traps and it's just a deer. Oh. More meat for all of us, huh? Bunnies! <laughs> Fucking hell! What? Hey Alex, did you get anything from the trap? What's in my hand right now, mate? Yeah, I managed to catch a rabbit. What's with the blood on his shirt? Oh, this. It's from the rabbit I hunted earlier. Is it? It's a bit big for a rabbit. Anyways, um, let's head back, shall we? want to see if my friend Bob is alright. What's that awful smell? It's really bad. I need to investigate. Someone's dead. Oh dear. Yikes forever. What happened to this thing? This is dangerous. I need to tell Bob about this. What if that was what Pyak shot at? He's not telling the truth. God, the way he's just still stood there looking over. Bye bye, Pyak! Bye bye! <laughs> oh dear. Maybe Pyak's also. Oh. Why are you over there, Bob? Well, we're in danger. I found an unusual deer corpse. Unusual? What do you mean? It's hard to explain, but this place feels dangerous. And Pyak, he's been acting strangely. Yeah. Alright, we should leave this forest together. Does this mean we've got pets? Yay! I'm keeping a rabbit. <laughs> I bet it all turns out there's no creature. It's just those two playing a prank and being... Come on, we're in this together. Let's get out of here. Oh no. <gasps> ah! What is this? Uh oh, uh oh. Run! That was the end? Holy moly. I had quite a lot of fun playing this game. It was really spooky and really creepy. The minute you're in the forest, you already feel this on these. There was a few moments where it definitely gave me the chills. Like for example, when he goes to the toilet and then you see those red eyes in the background. When you see that random guy from behind that rock and he just like vanishes. And that jump scare at the start where he runs towards you as well. <laughs> I wasn't sure how the ending was going to come together. I thought maybe it was going to be that maybe there was no creature and we're just on a massive trip because we've been eating mushrooms. Maybe the huntsman and that um, strange dude was in on it. Maybe we got out and survived, me and Bob. Alright guys, if you have any game suggestions, we'll see you play. There is a link for that down below in the description or leave them in the comments. Like, subscribe, comment down below what you think and I'll see you. For the next time.